Cardi B getting divorced while pregnant. That sound like that average hood situation. Find a Pookie and Ray Ray get pregnant. Say you don't want a good man they born and then have a bunch of kids by him and say, it's just not working out. Much love to my brother Offset, man. Talented brother. Seemed like a real stand-down brother. Got much love for him. Got much love for Cardi, man. She got the best flow. One of the best flows out there. I don't know what this Sassy Red doing, but she sound like she write her own stuff and sound like she pick make her own beats. Man, she just terrible, man. I guess it's the shock. I guess it's the shock factor with her. <clears throat> but we don't know the situation with Cardi B and uh, Offset, man. Well, congratulations to their newborn babies and stuff like that, man. But I know a lot of women that's in a similar situation than that. I don't know how much of a Pookie and Ray Ray that offset is, but I know that a lot of women, they get pregnant, they wait till they get in relationships or get married with a guy. And then all of a sudden, they ready to divorce them once they get married and have babies by them. That is amazing. You know what I'm saying? It's supposed to be for better and for worse to to do us part, it shouldn't be no, you know, so quick to leave, so quick to have this, so quick to have babies, so quick to get married, but so quick to leave. I mean, that is strange, man. I just find that kind of, kind of strange. I don't know if y'all find it strange, but I find it strange, man. You know, but that's the new thing. Uh, women just don't, you know, they're doing it what they want to do. Modern day women doing what they want to do how they want to do it you know they don't got no cut cards they don't have no cut cards you know it's just they think about consequences later they react now and think later they think about the consequences when they happen they don't think about the possibilities ahead of time they only think about the possibilities when it happened they think about when it happened they don't they live in their life to now they have a thousand babies now they will have use no come you know what i'm saying they'll marry anybody you know what i'm saying they just not thinking i don't want no good man they boring blah 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 they just feel like some women just feel like they're gonna always be able to get a man no matter what even if they got 50 kids and that's probably kind of true May not be able to get a real man. I mean, may not be able to get a good man, or I mean, may be able to get a good man, but, but it's 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 kind of true because it's a lot of simples out there, a lot of Simpsons. So, a lot of women can go through life and have babies by a million guys and get ran through or whatever, and uh, still end up with somebody, and still talk to him like some trash after he took her at her worst. At her last stage of life. You know what I'm saying? Her last beauty. Meat curtains. So many guys done slobber robber on her. You know what I'm saying? And she, they just still take them. But, you know, every guy ain't working with the same mental that mental deck. But I'm Alan Ray and hit that like button, subscribe button, notification bell button. Um, Stay prayed up in Jesus' name, man. Follow me on Instagram, all that stuff. You know what I'm saying? Really in there on Instagram. And uh, just stay positive out there, man. And pray for our women out here. Pray for the sisters. Pray for the lost guys. Pray for the simps. Pray for the wimps. Pray for the troublemakers. Alan Ray in there, y'all. We out.